listening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a clown evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. The strains of the national anthem of Australia. This turns on Jim. Yeah, Paolo Dybala. His game's all about control and subtlety rather than power and strength. But that doesn't make it any less effective. He can go past defenders with a couple of silky skills, create shooting opportunities for himself, or open things up for a few teammates. He's also a huge, huge threat from set plays. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. So it's away we go then. De Chilio. De Ligt. Rogic. Rogic spreads it towards the left. Rogic. Forward it goes. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Arthur Chiellini Chiesa the Accusatory stare there tells the whole story uh, That was just poor decision making and a weak execution Rogic. Lecky! That has certainly tested the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. in towards the centre. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Oh, looks like he's been taken out there. Lecky plays it backwards, and they'll try again. Get the pass he's looking for. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Rogic. Rogic really struggling to influence the game. Uh, he needs a minder, and one of his teammates should be picking up on that, and quickly. Lecky. Needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Chiellini. Oh, real danger, and the finish! Oh, stitch defending, but that'll do.
Juventus can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. And the first 45 minutes are on both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. It's the first half compared with your expectation. Unspectacular but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. So they head in, no further forward. The score here, still, nil-nil. And we are already, and he's good for it! He scored! The second half sparked straight into life! Was there ever any doubt? Yeah, he just calmly faced the keeper and waited. It became a, a who blinks first situation. And for me, there was never any doubt as to who was going to come out on top. Juventus have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Australia draw first blood here. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half time, it's worked a treat. Chiesa. And it's Quadrado. Arthur, great strength, too strong for his opponent. Goes for goal! Oh, denied brilliantly! The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Plays it out to the wing. Robbie Cruz tries lifting it over. Danilo knocks it away. Chiesa. Longo battles to win it back. Has a goal! They've scored! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe. Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. So that's two now without reply. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. And here's Dybala. And Dybala! Benedict. Rogic is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, and having played his part in the goal, a tightening up was inevitable. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And here's Morata. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Going for goal! He has done it! Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. 
That's brilliant play all round. Australia can make their change now with uh, a break in play. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, they've given themselves a chance here, but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defence, and that's not easy. Logic. Australia are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. Chiesa. And it's played forward. Beradeski. Juventus to get it into the box and quickly just brushed off the ball there and here's Dybala good ball it's found its target Juventus don't have many options and time is running out played in by Dechilio keeper has beaten it away Chiesa gets it back and back to base The referee brings it to a close. Australia win it by the odd goal. Almost nothing in it. Perhaps a draw would have felt fairer. And that's the game, and they have won it at the margin. To summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim. Well, I have to admit, Peter, that I had this mark down as a, a draw at best, but their tactical approach and industry was superb.